You know him as part of the lovable morning show on Mix 93.3's Rocket and Teresa show. But in December of 2019, he was off the air and in the emergency room. He had ignored his symptoms for too long. I, I was very stubborn and should have listened to myself. And it would have been my own fault had I not uh, had help and support from my daughter to get to the ER right now. Rocket thought his shortness of breath was his asthma acting up. In reality, he was in congestive heart failure, in part due to a rare birth defect he knew nothing about. His symptoms were extreme. And so if he had not come into the hospital, his heart would have continued to fail and he would have ended up dying from it. Rocket would need a valve replacement. He wasn't a candidate for open heart surgery. So at North Kansas City Hospital, doctors chose a much less invasive procedure, a transcatheter aortic valve replacement. And a lot of people are just too sick to undergo open heart surgery. And this has saved a lot of lives since it uh, was developed. Rocket says he's lucky to be alive, but he cut it close. So he has this message for others. You have one life, one body. Please listen to your body. Don't be afraid to talk to doctors. Stand up because you may not be here in the future if you don't take care of your hearts. Kelly Eckerman, KMBC 9 News.